Hello, I'm attorney Randolph Rice, a Maryland criminal defense attorney. Today I want to talk about the new possession of marijuana laws in Maryland. Now it's currently May of 2014. The governor just signed a number of new bills passed in this uh, previous legislative session. And those all uh, laws will go into effect October 1st of 2014. One of the new laws, which has been uh, some interest to the individuals, is the new marijuana laws in Maryland, the possession of marijuana less than 10 grams. The governor signed the bill, which now makes that a civil offense. And the penalties and penalties are not criminal anymore, they are civil, meaning the first offense results in a maximum fine of $100. The second offense, our subsequent offense, is a $250 fine, and then it goes up to a third or subsequent offense, which is a $500 fine. Now, the one thing that the legislature did not do was they did not change the laws that deals with possession of paraphernalia. And most individuals that are charged with possession of marijuana are also charged with possession of paraphernalia. Possession of paraphernalia is still a criminal charge. It'll be interesting to see what the state's attorney's office, as well as the courts, will do in October. But if you are stopped, the police officer may issue a civil citation for possession of marijuana less than 10 grams and issue a criminal citation or a criminal charge for the possession of paraphernalia, which is a maximum penalty of 500 days, but still is heard as it must appear and is heard in the criminal courts and the district court. Keep in mind that possession of marijuana, even though it is civil, may still appear on your record or in the Maryland Judiciary Case Search which means future employers, as well as schooling or loan officers or people trying to lend you money, or the community in general may be able to still see that you've had a possession of marijuana charge on that, on your record. That is why it is so important to still hire an attorney. You may want to challenge the, uh, the arrest, the search, or how the police found that marijuana. In addition, you may want to contact a lawyer and hire a lawyer to try to work out something so that it does not appear on your record and you can expunge it or shield it from your record down the road. If you've been charged with possession of marijuana, possession of paraphernalia, or any type of drug charges in Maryland, give me a call at my office 24 hours a day, seven days a week to schedule a free consultation. 